Chinese President Xi Jinping on Sunday made a four-point proposal on further advancing women's rights worldwide while addressing a high-level summit at the United Nations headquarters. She said China would, in the next five years, build a hundred health centers and a hundred school startups for girls in the developing world. Speaking at the Global Leaders Meeting on Gender Equality and Women's Empowerment, she said the pursuit of gender equality is a great cause. For a review of history shows that without women's liberation and progress, the liberation and progress of mankind would not be attainable. The first. We should strive for women's development in tandem with social and economic progress. The president said countries should protect women's rights and interests, which are basic human rights and must be protected by laws and regulations, and integrated into national and social rules and norms. We must build up women's capacity of playing their part in the society and economy, involve women in higher levels of decision making. And support them in becoming leaders in political, business, and academic fields. He added that countries must ensure sufficient basic medical services for women, ensure that school is affordable and safe for every girl, and develop vocational and lifelong education for women to help them better adapt to changes in society and the job market. The president also proposed to make joint efforts to build harmonious and inclusive societies, as a society with less discrimination or prejudice against women is often more inclusive and dynamic. We must eradicate all forms of violence against women, including domestic violence. We should focus on gender equality and dismiss outdated mentalities and customs inhibiting women's development. Fourth, she called for fostering a global environment favorable for women's development. We must stand firmly for peace, development, and win-win cooperation. Cherish peace dearly and uphold it. So that every woman and child will enjoy the sunshine of happiness and tranquility. The president called on women's organizations in different countries to strengthen interactions, urging development countries to scale up financial and technological assistance to developing countries and narrow the development gap among women in different countries. UN Secretary General Ban Ki Moon thanked the Chinese government for initiating the meeting, which will be a milestone in the cause of international women's development. He called on governments of all states to take measures to ensure gender equality while implementing the post-2015 development agenda.